Hello, welcome back to Colony Ship, the best place to get a 101 flavor burger. Now this is the Spy Hunt quest, I started the last video and to be honest it's one of the more interesting ones and I'm not sure if I will be able to solve it this game. We will see. Anyway, we just killed some soldiers because they're corrupt. Use the key card? Nah, use the... Wait a minute, do I have a key card? I guess I have. But we'll use the lock picking, of course. I guess you could have also used the electronics, but the electronics is my electronics is so low now. Okay, let's read the story because this is actually an important part. What is how he has a cybernetic eye? I hear you you've been looking for me. A silhouette separate itself from the shadows. You can see it's a man, and that's all you can see. Yeah. What happened with you and Madison? If Thought it was time to bury the hatchet between the protectors and the brotherhood, the executive committee buried him instead. Do you expect me to believe that the commander of the protectors military wanted to negotiate with, with the enemy? I don't care what you believe, if you don't like the truth, you can always go back to their propaganda broadcast. The executive council says Matheson was working for the brotherhood. Huh. If they admit that Matheson wanted peace, people start asking questions. No one no one in authority likes questions. If the executive council is so powerful, why would Matheson risk his life talking to the brotherhood? You should you would have to ask him that. I'm just a messenger, not his confident. Now let me ask you something. Are you here to kill me or help me escape? Escape. Thank you, friend. The man's shoulders sag with relief and steps closer, bring his face into the light. The only way to cross over without triggering the sensor is via maintenance. That route is wide open but heavily guarded. We can fight them, but it would be a lot if we can find a way to sleep pass quietly. Yeah, you know, quiet is my speciality. Sneaking, I'm a sneaking expert. I can sneak behind the dog's back and steal his bone. Eh, not really. Okay, now I have to go over here. Now, you can do this uh, a few ways, but to be honest, they're all dangerous. So I just recommend coming here to the cantina. Propose a toast. That's not enough. Steal the key card. And then you steal the key card. Can we still talk to him? Oh yeah, so the cart was next to the bottle. Another part of the game I don't understand is why certain doors close or you cannot open them, you cannot go back. I mean, yeah, it is what it is, but yeah. Also, stealing is at 6 now. And yeah, we can fight them directly, but those turrets are kind of uh, annoying. They are not the strong turret type, they are just the turret we faced before, I think, in yeah, in the pit. But the problem will be that this guy is an elite soldier, so we don't want to fight the elite soldier. Cut. And over here we have a few other problems. Hack the computer. Yeah, you need a lot of computers for this one. Deactivate the turret or open the hatch. I guess we will tag the nearby guards as enemy combatants and then we'll also open the hatch, why not? Try to fix it. Stop the modules. I guess this would have been good electronics experience as well, but I don't have that one. Okay, Mr. Engine Computer. I guess you can increase your... Yeah, okay. Well, I guess we can sneak again. I think they introduced a lot more sneaking to the game. I don't remember so many sneaking options. Wait. Oh, I see the problem. So if you want to sneak, you'll have to... Okay. The turret should be under my control anyway. It's the Predator. I 
this doesn't really matter because they'll just shoot me once or twice. And you don't have the chance to start the combat. I guess it's not so bad. Good crit Evans. <laughs> oh how I like these turrets. Oh I like them when they're on my side of course. Oh, yeah, why have I my chance to hit solo because of the range? Hmm, why is my oh it's one of those enemies that has a lot of evasion. Well, not if you hit him in the legs. Well, we tried our best, but no leg shot. If it works, it works. Yeah, probably this is kind of like a little bit of an abuse because you can basically go and use the cloaking device the very next... Anyway, it doesn't matter, it's okay. It's going to be okay. So that will get the experience, sadly. You risk your life to save mine, don't forget it. I don't have anything to give except this hands your small drive. Matheson's last message addressed to Silas Rees. Police and the council. Interesting, isn't is it not? That's my rifle. Yeah, I, I'm really waiting for the update where they switch where I can switch back to my normal. Why is it so loud here? Oh, because of that. So what did these guys have? I really want the smaller icons. This is too big. XM7. This is a good SMG. As you can see, if you are not prepared for this fight, they'll definitely kill you. And this is one of the best SMGs in the game. Because it has accuracy, aim, critical chance, penetration and a little bit of stagger. Control Council, yeah. Well, it's, it's, it's an assault rifle, but I don't know, it has a cool look to it. Diver Arm Guards M7, XM5, so some machine gun. This is an assault rifle, by the way. This is some machine gun, but they also call this a sub machine gun, okay. So this is where the inconsistency starts to appear. I guess I can write the developers about this. XM7 is an assault rifle, but the text says it's a sub machine gun. But we also get another biolab max, biolab mask, and I think we need we have four now. Might be mistaken, and we'll need to go to that final area in the factory. Let's compare them. Accuracy is two. Yeah, so this is as you can see an automatic rifle, a saw rifle. Oh, this looks so much cooler. Well, it technically is an assault rifle, so you need the rifle skill, and we have the rifle skill. Accuracy, aim, everything is much better, plus the AP cost is 6, it's not, it's not 7 anymore. Beautiful. I love when I can upgrade the gear of my characters. Also, like I previously said, you should be able to loot the ammunition from these things. Wait. Oh, that's it, you're stuck here and you have to... Oh, ah, kind of annoying, but okay. Uh, yes, I'm ready to return to Buford. Oh, that, that should have been fixed a while ago. 
the spy got away. Incident in one of the detention centers. Is it? Why, then why did you... Why were you seen entering the facility? It's good to observe some questions for him, but I told them I was working for you. They wish me a good day and let me go. Tell them you are working for me loud and clear. Bastard. It's very Sheffield's problem now, so let me worry about it. What do you have to report? Can you explain that? The security apparatus fighting the enemy within. The military is fighting the enemies without. Oh, okay. Sheffield, the head of the mission security, is sitting on the executive council. Why did they detain me then? Mission security, they are looking for a spy. Spy is dead. Don't expect a reward without producing the body. Your lucky day, Cargoret. <laughs> the new commander wants to talk with you. Yeah, see, this is what I don't like. Sometimes you're just going to get dragged into events and conversations. Silas, please, the newly promoted commander. The spy's dead. Uh, I let him go. Why did you tell me about it? He told me Matheson was trying to negotiate peace with the Brotherhood. The executive committee killed him for that. He said they'd kill you too when you failed to deliver a military victory. But I guess you already know that. <laughs> it seems like the two of you had a nice long chat. We did. It was pleasant. The humming of the generators was... was... musical at some point. Silas looks you in the eye for the first time. He's silent for a moment and he decides your fate. Your new friend isn't wrong. Here, like the if I were to pursue peace, they would undoubtedly have me executed. If I fail to win the war that can't be won, they will have me executed. I don't have a lot of options. What do they want, then? Ever since the ship authority was overthrown, every commander that has been tasked with putting down the mutiny... ...has been tasked with putting down the mutiny. It's been a hundred years, yet the oath Matheson and I took along with his... ...doom command, yeah. Before Matheson was caught, there was kind of an unspoken understanding with the committee, but that's over now. They're, go they're going to insist on the war they've been hungering for the past 100 years. No excuses. The war you can't win. Maybe we can. We can. Who knows? Maybe the committee knows something I don't. Maybe the Brotherhood is weaker than they seem. How are the members appointed? They're born into it. Each committee member is a direct descendant of the original bridge officers, the mission personified. The lofty perch they occupy is so far above reproach, any failure must fall upon the commander. And failure at this level is no different than treason. Oh. Can't I simply seize power? They've been at the game for a long time and executed far more capable and executed far more capable commanders than me. If I try to move against them, they give the order before I even got up from this chair. Yeah, it's a tricky position. I like the way they made the story sound. As you can see, even if the basically the mutiny was 100 years ago, it's still not resolved and they have to maintain the peace until we get to that planet. That's why I really, really hope they make a sequel for the game, but make it less scripted, make it more open-ended, make it harder, but more open-ended. Because currently the game is not hard if you know what to do and what to expect. It doesn't really matter how you play the game if you make the right choices during character creation and during the trickle of level ups you get because when you're playing the game you're not going to do much maybe change a little bit of your gear but mostly you'll just select a few traits and that's it what are you going to do i'll buy some time my men are already being watched half of them are probably reported to the committee already but not you what do you want me to do talk to bill hanson the brotherhood chief find out what man person was offer then you stops your gathering there on their spy network Another matter. I'm listening. Can you just leave? Okay, that, that's that's a funny line. Uh, this is the Protectorate mission. The Protectorate committee, right? Right. It's nice and red. The 
The protectors are not the good guys, no matter how you look at things. So now we're... Oh, wow, why does it look like this? You can talk to a passerby? Well, if you have the option of dialogue, do the dialogue. Are you new too? How do you like it here? It's not what I expected. First mentioned this, you know that they're giving up for all, aren't they? Looks that way. Someone should, st someone should stop them. How do you stop a war? They don't attack if the Brotherhood knows they're coming. What if the Brotherhood knows their plan? What's in it for me? Looking a pointless war. Perform the health, there's plenty of that. I only want the files. What files? Oh, what do you have in mind? For the maintenance section, there's the initial deck. In just this building. I'm confused, the residential deck mission just is building. I guess it's for the protector, right? We stop the war? Absolutely. Alright, I'm in. I don't remember this quest. It must be an interesting one. I didn't even read I required sneaking. Ah, oh, I hate this so much. I just missed the old controls. I don't know why they had to change them. I don't think I'll need my knife, but I'll take it with me anyway. Tickle tickle, I'm the tickle monster. <laughs> yeah. This sneaking is it's too much fun sometimes. Lock pick six. Oh no. What will I do? I'll pick up and the lock. Okay. What? A house 74? It looks different than the one I have, but is it different? This is actually extremely good loot because it gives you one of the security forces helmet which is one of the best helmets in the game. And it has armor handling 6. Mm. So gel delicious. Wow, why is the loot so good in that particular building? I remember they said they introduced a few more mechanics. That's ridiculous. This is the, one of the best elements in the game and they're just giving it to me like this. For free. You also have accuracy and aim. While with this one I just have for accuracy. I'll take it. I mean, they do need a little more to armor handling, but it's okay. Well, confidence plus 10. But I will need to swap it out to the mask. Because the toxic resistance is 70 and for the other, these things is 80. Anyway, it doesn't matter. You'll see what I mean when we actually do the thing we have to do. 10, 8. Well, I might keep the eyes. I mean, I might keep these goggles because they have the reaction. Ah, you know what, it doesn't matter. Let's make him... <laughs> He'll lose his confidence boost. But look at this. Yeah. This is what I'm talking about. This is such a cool helmet. Intimidation rather than protection. So he... Not only that, but the... You get neural resistance, which is one of the more rarer things in the game. Well, that's mostly used for the frogs and some of the medusas, or you'll see what I mean a bit later. But it's still nice to get the optical resistance so high. 
is a beast now. So this is a Hauser 67. This is how. Oh, it's a 74. This one is much better. AP cost is 5. Still 5. 12 to 40. Okay. I really like comparing items in this game. I don't know why. Sorry about this. It's just one of my hobbies. <laughs> and even improved. This is the best steel alloy. So one more max damage. Range is improved by 1. Instead of 8, it's 9. Good. Accuracy 6. Accuracy is 12. Really? That's double the accuracy. Aim this 8. Health chance is 6. Penetra wow. Where did they get this creature? This this pistol over here is the best thing I've saw in a very long time. Well, I guess I prefer to have this one over here. Accuracy is 2, stagger. Yeah, I'll switch it out. I mean, I'll not use Faithful as a combat character that much anyway. We are getting some really good upgrades for our team. Yeah, even though they look like major upgrades, trust me, they're just small upgrades in the long term. But you know, you need every little help you can get in this game. 200 threads. Let's say 150. So we got 500 credits out of this. Yeah, I, I like the way they made the money be important, but I don't know. It feels like some things are really, really missing from the game. Like, better to do it or money. Just not just wait until you get the chance to buy the ov implant overclocks. Really hate it. Well, I guess we have to suffer for the game. That's because they have sec yeah yeah they have security cameras and you can see as you can see the security cameras move around. Not my favorite mechanic in the game. Now they have a guard. Here is go over. Here. I guess you, you never have to cross the red stuff. I guess we just activate the clocking field. Let me target it's out of reach. Wait, that's a very weird. How are you supposed to do it then? I don't see any other way. The weird one. So I go over there, and then what do I do? Activate this. I open this. I get an XM7, which I already had, and an XM5, which I already had. Not like I need anything from here. I just want to see if I can do this uh, another way or a better way. Apparently, we cannot really do it other ways. I can improve this clocking field, but I'm not sure if it's viable to do it now. That's new. Infiltrator boots. 87. I, I don't remember the infiltrator boots being in the game. Light reflector. Wow, that's actually extremely nice loot. And I guess that's all we can take. Sorry about this, I'm just cheesing the game too much, but I want to see if I can open this.
open this loot it the next turn can I go around no that will still end no that will yeah there's no way I can do it so I, I guess you just have to choose one that's that's the main takeaway from this part kind of stuck over there probably with the right traits you can get okay sorry about that i just was messing around too much maybe power set oh i could have used this wait a minute i uh, sorry okay let's think about this i forgot to see if i had power cells I have a power cell, okay. Maybe we can do both of them. Completely forgot about this. No, you cannot do it because as soon as you open one of them, I think you get automatically detected. Or this will turn red. I can go over. Yeah, yeah, okay. So, there really is no way to get both of them, or at least my knowledge, my limited knowledge. Enemy detection is 35 per turn. This is a Mark II. Doesn't seem like much, but it actually would mean they would need an extra turn to identify us. Now, how do I remember how the infiltrator lo legs look like? The infiltrator boots, as you can see, they don't lower or sneaking, so... He'll be wearing, he will be wearing them all the time. Yeah, good boots, good armor. So what was I wearing before? Armor handling is 3, this is 4, but 8 projectile, 6 projectile. That's actually a massive improvement in my opinion. Yeah, the other stuff I don't really need. It was just more guns that if you sell them, they'll be super cheap anyway. A very cool reward, so sneaking was massively improved in my opinion. Especially in the protectorate, why do we have so many sneaking opportunities over here? I don't remember this being so packed with the sneaking and the looting. Oh, that's it? Can I steal the light bulb or something else? No, that was it. Yeah, they said they introduced more sneaking opportunities, but this is ridiculous. It's a lot of <laughs> extra opportunities. Hey, okay, wow. Time flies when I'm playing this game. I don't know why. What do you sell? Ah, just the regular stuff, nothing interesting. Archive. Sorry, I'm not reading this, but it's in case you want to see more about the story. junk here and there but it's okay it's useful civil defense story yeah, it's, a, it's 
It's a defense store, it's exactly what you think it is. Now, do they have... Oh, that's a very cool dagger. It's a tactical dagger. It's super, super tactical. They have a house of 64 in case I want one, but I already have a lot of them. Oh, but they have a reinforced ballistic vest, which might be good for our friend Jed. Yeah, I think it will be better because it will not reduce his uh, armor so much and... I don't think I really need the extra one melee, but I could use the minus armor penalty, even though I'm pretty sure he has the armor penalty negated because he has the armor skill. I guess I don't need it. This is a high grade gas grenade. Ah, say that fast. High grade gas gen grenade. High grade gas grenade. Okay. Guess we can buy some of these. I don't know. I just like to have a big collection. Look at how beautiful everything is. Get me. Okay, so that's basically all. I think we finished the area, or maybe it not. I still have to check if there's another area over here, or what's the deal with this guy, and then over there. The area is massive, they really improved it a lot. Even though it doesn't seem like much, you might say, oh, it's only one extractive. No, no, it's much more than that. Education center. What manners of lessons are learned here? I am new here. How do you re-educate? What do you think? What do you think? Stay out of trouble. Oh, it's not so far away. Yeah, they really... They maximized the layout or... Not maximized, they optimized the layout. I forgot where I came from, but I think we finished everything. Uh, I think that's the hatch to stop the war. And I think this is where we were beforehand. Okay, I really want to do another mission. I talked to Hansen. I guess I can go there. I think already here. I think we already stole what we could steal without doing the quest from here. Yeah. Okay, I think I want to do this in this episode, so let's see if we can speak with Hanson. Last time I did this, I couldn't progress it because I didn't have the necessary stats. Not speak with him right now. Hold on. Who is Hanson? Commander Silas Z sent you to Chairman Hansen to find out what Matheson was after. Who is that guy? I guess he is really in the Brotherhood in this building, but how do you access him? I guess you have to do this mission first. Irony, yes. What do you have to do? Meeting. Why me?
They will tell me. This is one of the parts of the parts of the game I'm not sure I'll be enjoying that much. Let's do this part over here. Oh yeah, I remember this area. I said I would come later to it. Because I couldn't do it when I first arrived. Look at us! For the sneaking skill. Eh, and they put a guard. It's exactly as in the protectorate. So what was in here? Heat absorber mark one. And some energy cells. I like that. Uh, that's all that was here, right? Right. But we've got the thing we're looking for. is the heat absorber. Which means the enemy will have a much harder time finding us with the thermal vision. Oh, that's that's a huge bonus, actually. So we might, able, we might be able to stay the full three turns in cloak mode. Yeah. I'm not sure what to say about that, the developers definitely are making Sneak a little too powerful. We need more electronic experience. Nothing? That's unfortunate. Brotherhood. Okay, let's let's see if it matters if we select another one. Okay. Take him out quietly. I guess I, if I had critical six. I'm sure there's much more to this. I'll try to kill him and see if he has much better loot. Anyway, we haven't done much today just because of how incredibly packed the game can be in events after you reach the habitat. And after that, it's kind of... Oof, no events. I'm looking for Anders. Thank you. That's how you enter this place. That's how you'll get to the, the residential text. Okay, see you next time. Bye-bye.